Hi there, Angela here at So Bright Alpine Quilting and welcome to our weekly update for the Boho Heart Quilt Sew Along. So I still have my quilt on the machine, haven't had a chance to get to it this week, but it gives me a chance to now show you a, quite a bit of quilting that I've done. So if Steve likes to bring the camera right down onto the surface here, you can see that I've finished doing all of the white quilting. So I've done that nice wiggly line all the way up through all of the strips and then continued it up through the middle of the quilt and then just quilting any white areas as I go along. So that was fun. So as I mentioned last week, I am using a um, ruler and I've got my ruler foot on and I'm trying to practice and make myself better at doing ruler work. So I've also got my quick curve at ruler that I'm using to quilt some curves and a um, petal shape ruler from Angela Walters as well. So I thought I'd just uh, pop in and say hi. I'm still quilting and um, let you see me do a bit of quilting. So I'm just over here on the owl and so I'm just going to go, I've got red thread on, a red variegated thread and I'm just going to go do some echo quilting around the body of the owl here to complement this uh, red stitching that we've done. So hopefully we won't get any thread breakages and here we go. Okay, so now that's done, we can move on to another spot. So to move on, we just cut our threads. So that just brings the bottom thread up and we can move to another spot. So if we just roll the quilt up a little bit, I can do in that little bit there. Say hi if you're there, let us know how you're going with your quilt. And I'll just do a little uh, scroll around this section here of this log cabin. So we bring the bobbin thread up like we do on our normal free motion quilting. Tie that off a little bit. Snip the threads to get them out of the way. And we'll just do a little scroll. That's that little bit done. So I'm not um, doing a whole lot of quilting across it. I don't think it needs to be quilted to death. Um, so as I said, I've just anchored most areas in the white and now I'm going back with a couple of different colors. So I've been across one way with uh, some bluey purple and now I'm just going back across with the red and I think that'll probably do it. And uh, so next week you'll be able to see it all bound and hanging and ready to go. So don't forget to post your updates. Let us know if you need any fabric. So I've put together some bundles of um, the fabrics that I've used. Pretty much most of them, a couple of them are already out of stock. So you can either go with the pre-cut um, bundles from Free Spirit and they are mainly in a warm colour or a cool colour. If you want a mixture like I've done, I can put together some uh, fat quarters for you of that. And then I have two com 
complementary bundles. One has all the black and whites and the stripes that I've used, and the other one is a um, set of 23 low volume ones that you can cut into the strip. So you get 23 15 centimeters, and uh, that will do you for all your low volumes in the background. Anyone saying hello? Nobody saying hello? You can all watch it later anyway. Hopefully it'll post okay. I don't know what happened last week. I must have pressed the wrong button. But anyway, we'll see you next week. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.